So I wanted to show you guys legitimately a person who's starting up a business and has no idea what they're doing. Because currently that's me. Currently looking for some trim. Oh. oh, I thought you hit me. Oh, I didn't even get you. You get that one, but it's the bottom stick at the wall. Oh! Oh my god. We're getting 172 a 1 by 3. I'm currently painting these baby blocks for the baby shower tomorrow. I think they came out so cute. They are custom made. And it's currently about 10.30 at night. I always wait to the last minute. It's just when well, my husband's vacuuming at 10.30 at night. But it came out so cute. And I'm gonna put like, see these little letters to match the actual blocks. And they're gonna spell out the baby's name. So, can't wait for you guys to see. This is gonna be so freaking adorable. It's something I saw in my head. My husband helped make it into a vision. Can't wait for y'all to see. So I wanted to show you guys legitimately a person who's starting up a business and has no idea what they're doing because currently that's me i see all of these beautiful like pictures and all this stuff when it comes to planning events ain't nobody talking about how they how they got there because it's hard work now i'm off to do the balloon garland which i am going to show you guys which is the point of this actual video um for a baby shower setup she wanted to do a boy story which is a play on toy story baby shower because she's having a boy so it's called the boy story it's so cute i never heard of it and her baby shower is tomorrow um i have been running around trying to do it so i was up last night until like 2 a.m in the morning i put it on my instagram story if you don't follow me make sure you follow because that's where i put most of behind the scenes stuff hopefully this is meaningful if it is definitely give this a thumbs up let me know if this is something you love to learn and i'll keep doing it or every other week i'll do it to show you guys what it takes to run an event designing business <laughs> all right so let's get started i have to go home blow some balloons head over to the house where the balloon arch is going to be located and then we'll go from there so i'm almost done with these baby blocks they came out so cute and then there's one right there. That's how they're all gonna come. So the letters. I'm gonna spell out the baby's name. It's gonna be so cute. But I forgot to get the Roman numeral four because I thought I was gonna be creative and do it. And it didn't work out like that. So I'm going to the store now. Back to the store. Putting the letters on. Then I'm gonna head out there and put the balloon garland up. Here is an update. I have to go back to Joanne's, but yeah. I mean, guys, I needed one of the letters for the Roman numerals, but I was just on this side of town. Literally to drove 20 minutes to my car. Found out I forgot to go, and now I'm back. Life as an event designer. It never fails. So I'm off to another store, not because I wanted to, but because I forgot something. But let me see if I can flip my camera. And I'm going to Joanne's. Now Joanne's is a little overrated or underrated. I don't know. I never know which one to use. We're focused and we're not going to buy anything besides what we need. So I finally came to what I need, and they only have one 
and to these, which I'm trying to make a Roman numeral. But I need three of each. So this means I have to go all the way to the other side because there's only like two joints within 10 mile radius and find and make sure that they have it. If not, I gotta think of something clever. So if you follow me on Instagram, you know we only had a few of the letters that I needed, but I need more. So now I gotta go to the store all the way on the other side of town, but I gotta do it. So otherwise it's gonna look crazy. So stay tuned. So they have the V that I need, but they don't only have one I. So I'm gonna be creative and do something with this H instead, because that's what weird boy. So I went to the other store and I got the um, the other letters, but the only one was I didn't. They only had one I, and I needed two. So I'm gonna do a little DIY with this H. I don't know if you can tell what I'm going to do, but we'll see how this works out. So I ended up cutting the H that I showed you guys and turned it into an I. And you really can't tell which one. Oh, where's that one? You really can't tell. I honestly don't even know. I don't know, I can't tell. But these things came out so cute. Now, I know it's missing this. These, I just figured it was a waste of money to put letters that were gonna face the back. But look how cute. I'm about to pack right now because I have to go meet her to set up because their baby shower's tomorrow. It's gonna be so cute. Yesterday was awesome. Like as you can see, the baby shower came out dope. I am currently on a photo shoot, but this is one of my outfits. It's a little makeup, but the pictures are gonna be so awesome. I can't wait for you guys to see. If you don't follow me, I'm gonna put them all over my social media, and my website. It will all be linked down below. Um, if you like this video, make sure to give it a big like and comment down below if this is something you'd like to see and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye. I need a, a camera stand for my car because my arm is hurting. It's not good.